technologies. The concepts aim to inspire new ideas for underwater combat in the future. Commander Peter Pipkin, the Royal Navy's fleet robotics officer, said, Today's Royal Navy is one of the most technologically advanced forces in the world, and that's because we have always sought to think differently and come up with ideas that challenge traditional thinking. In the 18th century the Royal Navy began sheathing ships in copper, dramatically improving speed, and the dreadnought revolutionized naval warfare in the run-up to World War I. The new concepts were dreamed up by scientists from B-Systems, Rolls-Royce, Lockheed Martin and the Ministry of Defense, who were asked to envisage submarine warfare in 50 years' time. The challenge was to design craft that are cheap to run and deadly in battle. Commander Pipkin added, if only 10% of these ideas become reality, it will put us at the cutting edge of future warfare and defense operations. So how do the designs look? Based on a hybrid between a whale shark and a manta ray, the mothership's hull would be 3D printed and built from super strong alloys and acrylics, with surfaces that can morph in shape. With tunnel drive propulsion similar to a Dyson bladeless fan, it could travel at 150 knots, sucking water through the band expelling it from the stern. A crew of 20 would live on board, and the vessel could dock at underwater stations based around the world. Launched from weapons bays on the mothership and themselves armed, these submarines would travel hundreds of miles in near silence using sine wave propulsion. Their main purpose would be to eject individual sensor pods that use lasers to communicate with each other, forming an underwater communication network. These gizmos would be launched from the AIL vessels in large groups, and could be directed to block uptakes and intakes on enemy craft, rendering them inoperative. They could carry out reconnaissance, shadow foreign submarines or undertake escort duties. Made from saltwater-soluble polymers, like capsules for washing machines, they can be dissolved when